Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how Intact Accounts Payable payment approval process works. All right, so let me give you some background information. Uh, I have two different users here, Alex, who is the requester, and here I have Dave, who is the approver. So let me go back to Alex and show you a couple of bills I have already posted in the system. So I have one invoice for $2,000, one for $400, and the other one for $1,000. Now in my configuration, I have said, I only need approvals for bills that are more than $500. And if the bill is less than $500, I do not require an approval, All right? So let's see how it's gonna work. So Alex, go here, go to accounts payable, and go to pay bills. So based on my filters, these are the three bills that are due as of today. So I click here and click on pay now. So at this point, system will send a notification, uh, approval notification to the approver. Okay. In the meantime, Alex can go here and go to view payment request and have a look at the status of those uh, requests. Right. So if you look at here, the, the one for the $400 is automatically approved. That's because we do not require an approval if the bill is less than $500, right? So let me show you uh, the email. Uh, uh, email. So here's the payment, so here's the email. A payment request have been submitted. Uh, request is Alex and here's the date. So the approver can click here, then it'll automatically take um, approve to the approve payments screen in intact. So now here's Dave, who is the approver. Dave can approve one by one, or else you can click here and approve everything at once, right? But before I do that, Dave also can drill down to each of these bills and have a look at the details, right? If they are coded to the right dimension, right? And also here it shows if there's any attachment attached to the original bill. Now this one has an attachment, so Dave can simply click here. And so here's the bill details and you can click here and that will show you the, the attachment attached to the, to the document, original bill, all right? So let's say that everything is good to go. So Dave can come here and select all and click on approve. So at this point, the bills are, the payments are approved. So now, um, Alex can simply go here and go to view payment request. So I should be able to see the status. All three have been approved, right? And also Alex should get an email notification saying the, the payments have been approved by Dave, right? So from this point, Alex go here and go to print checks and select the checking account. Uh, so these are the checks to be printed. Click here and click on print, right? So currently this is a check format in my sample environment. Uh, we also can include the signature as well. We can scan the signature and insert into the system. So when you're printing the checks, it will automatically insert the signatures as well, All right? So at this point, uh, you print uh, these checks to the printer and click uh, the X mark here and click confirm. So then it will post the payments. So that's about it. And uh, thank you for watching.